Hey guys, it's Gathalion, and today we're going to take another look at some of the cool things that NVIDIA Shield can do. Some of these things you might know, some you might not know, so let's get right into it. Today we're going to take a look at how to stream GameCube and Wii games to your NVIDIA Shield. First things first, let's get to Steam. Once you're in Steam, you're going to want to add your Dolphin emulator as a non-Steam game. You can do this by clicking the Add Game down at the bottom and add non-Steam game. It'll bring up a menu and you'll find your Dolphin emulator, click it, and then hit Add Game. Basically, adding this to your library as a non-Steam game allows your shield to access it through the big picture mode that goes through Steam. So you'll launch your Steam app and then you'll pick it out of your library. But before we get any further into that, you're going to want to make sure that your controller is properly configured within your Dolphin emulator. Go into the GameCube controller options and make sure that X input device is selected. This allows your Dolphin emulator to recognize your NVIDIA Shield as if it were an Xbox 360 controller or a standard X input device. Alright, let's move on to the next step. Okay, now you're going to want to turn on your Shield. Once you're in Shield, go ahead and launch your Tegra Store app. Go down, access your PC, and launch Steam from there. Once you're in Steam, go over to your library. This is where you'll access the Dolphin emulator. As you can see, I've already accessed it. But if you haven't already, you're going to want to go to View All Games and find the Dolphin emulator in there. Go ahead and activate the Dolphin emulator. Once inside, you're going to have to actually navigate the emulator with your mouse from your computer. Let's go ahead and launch Wind Waker. Once you launch the game, you're untethered from your computer. This is a great time to note that when running Wii and GameCube games on the Dolphin emulator, you can upscale the graphics to high resolution. So while people on Wii U are waiting till October 4th to play Zelda Wind Waker in HD, well, you can play it from your toilet on your NVIDIA Shield. And as you guys can see, I'm navigating through Wind Waker's menus with complete ease as if I was using a normal gamepad, all while streaming on my NVIDIA Shield. Please note that in order to obtain games legally, you must own them first. There's various ways to rip the game onto a digital copy on your hard drive, but you must own the games in order to run them legally on your Dolphin emulator. Check the description for a link to where you can download the Dolphin emulator. And as always, don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Hit that thumbs up button. It lets me know that you guys are liking these Android videos, these tutorials for the NVIDIA Shield. If you found them informative or helpful, again, that thumbs up lets me know that you're liking them. And I'll see you guys in the next video.